at the top tonight. The mayor of Port Aransas voicing concern tonight about one part of the Port of Corpus Christi ship channel dredging project. It seems dredging in the main ship channel will require a Port Aransas water line to be moved and the city may have to pay for it. The mayor says the timing is terrible. Our Madeline Dart has the details on this top story tonight. Maddie. Joe City officials in Port Aransas were told they would have to cover half of the cost to move the line, which could be around $5 million. The Port Aransas mayor believes it shouldn't be their responsibility to pay for a project that isn't theirs. Yet Port officials say they may not have a choice. Since the project is occurring in a federal channel, Sean Strawbridge with the Port of Corpus Christi says it's the responsibility of the pipeline owners to pay for its removal or relocation. Yet Mayor Charles Bujan says they still need $100 million to recover from Hurricane Harvey, and an extra cost will push those efforts back even further. So unfortunately, I think that $5 million uh, may be shifted over uh, at some point to the taxpayers. And they will not like this at all, period. Starbridge says because Port Aransas water line is being relocated, they may be able to help ease the costs. We certainly recognize that some agencies have some funding challenges, and so the Port of Corpus Christi is certainly prepared to help where we can. But whenever there is an easement that's granted by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, in all of those easements, there is a provision where if the Army says that that line has to be removed, it has to be removed. Strawbridge added he has not yet heard from the water district that serves Port Aransas. Joe. All right, Maddie, thank you.